I was leaving Fry Creek Trail on Palomar Mountain in San Diego, California, when I encountered these beautiful trees that were very large next to the road. They had these beautiful showy flowers that looked like orchids. And so I had to stop and get some footage of this. So if you notice, there's a lot of buzzing in the background. It's because those are monster flies that are utterly disgusting. They're not bees. I don't mind bees. Um, so these flowers look like orchid flowers. And when I did a Google search, when I got home, I saw that you know this was the first thing that came up, and I instantly recognized these. Uh, usually I have to do many, many searches in the literature online to find you know, and identify a plant species. And this one was very pleasantly easy to identify. The tree we're looking at here is Catalpa bignanoides. They're deciduous trees that grow 15 to 18 meters tall. Here we have a very large carpenter bee digging its head into one of these orchid-like flowers. I always like seeing carpenter bees. And there are smaller winged insects, such as this beetle, that take up residence inside these large flowers that are about two to four centimeters in diameter. There are many of those little buggers inside. So the catalpa trees are loved because they provide a lot of shade. They have beautiful foliage and very beautiful flowers. They produce fruits that are these long, thin, bean-like pods, 20 to 40 centimeters long, and eight to 10 millimeters in diameter. So they're very long and stringy looking, and they tend to fall off at kind of a leisurely pace throughout the rest of the year and that bugs some people. So what we're looking at here is uh, maybe a bunch of saplings or adventitious shoots looking into the valley views. Um, it's a very beautiful scene. You should definitely check it out if you live nearby. So at this time of year the mountains are heavily infested with all sorts of flying insects. Uh, there are just monster flies landing on my hair and making it crawl. They were that big. So when I lifted my head to give you this understory view they were it was just landing all over my face again, my lips. It was just utterly disgusting. And when I was done filming and got into my car and started disinfecting everything, you hear these monster flies landing on the outside of my car. So here's a demonstration of how big my hand is when I stretch it out like that. It reaches about nine inches in length from thumb to middle finger. So a quick browse online shows that some people say these leaves can reach, I don't know, like 12 inches long and certainly less wide and you can see from my hand here these leaves are just enormous I don't know why they're so big in this part of the shade for this one tree but they are and I've never seen anything like this and these veins are huge so basically I'm measuring here that's nine inches you know I'm beset by flies here totally disgusted at the time and that's another nine inches so that's 18 plus 1 maybe, that's 19 inches, and that would be maybe 16 inches across, so that's truly huge.